Yo, what is going on today, fam? So we're back again today. And today is the day, it's time for the EP3 to come apart. Um, some of y'all may know, some of y'all may not know, but I also have an EG Civic. Like, I'm a big Honda dude. I really don't show it on the channel that much. But I bought uh, this uh, EP3 Type R with the intentions to pull the motor um, and do a case swap into my EG hatch. So today we're gonna be basically uh, stripping this carcass uh, like some wild dogs in the uh, Sahara Desert, you know what I'm saying? And yeah, so uh, Brandon, he has a gray EP3 SI, so he's gonna be taking off a lot of these parts for me and then he's gonna be incorporated into his own build. And Brandon got his own channel too. What's your channel, bro? Hunter for the win. So yeah, it's gonna be a lot of content on the way. Oh, I'm super stoked in the way that this worked out because my original plan was I was gonna take all these parts back to the States and then part it out from there, you know, and just sell the parts one by one. But it just worked out perfectly with Brandon, you know, like it's called the same exact color and everything. And he's already here. And we were able to come up with, I think was a, a pretty fair deal, you know, for everything. So that ended up working out, but yeah, so. Right now, uh, Brandon's working on pulling out the front bumper. He's doing that right now. I'm gonna go ahead and just remove the hood just to get that out of the way. And kind of, man, just go through the car. You know, like there's no game plan we have necessarily. We're just gonna go ahead and just start stripping the car down. So rear bumper's off, right there. One step closer <laughs> to the ultimate prize. So working through this right now. Um, I'm about to pull out the seats right quick. I'm gonna be keeping the seats. I might use those in my in my EG build. I already took out the batteries. So after that, gonna start going through there, man. So we just going through. I think he about to finish up the front bumper right now. But you just want to raise up the car, bro. <laughs> so progress is being made pretty well. I guess, I guess we're how long you say we've been here? 40, yeah, so we about, let's say 40 minutes in and already got all this out. And we got another a member of the team that just joined us. Got Q Diddy with the titties, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, man, um, already took out the air box, all that stuff. I'm gonna take off the shifter cables, took out the battery. Um, still need to drain the radiator, remove the radiator, so that way we can pull off this whole front bumper support here to have better access to the engine. And then I plan to pull it out from the top just to make my life easier. So let's get it. We got some pretty harsh light, but got this front little radiator support thing off. I'm about to pull off this front support right there. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and drain the fluid out of the radiator. From there, we have to evacuate the AC system um, and get rid of that. We do have the proper uh, tools to do that, don't worry about that. But um, yeah, so things are going pretty well. Uh, Kieran got the seats out already. As you can see, it's pretty bare. Uh, Brand is working on getting all the center console out. He, as you can see, he's He's taking all this out right here. Um, we still gotta take the doors off. Brandon's gonna take the steering wheel off. But man, we're making pretty good pro progress, honestly. I mean, I don't expect to get the engine out today. I'm not saying that it's not possible, because it is. But yeah, I guess we'll see. I'm 
the heart is out, the ECU, one day to be Han data, but this is the progress we made so far. Bitch. <laughs> so this is the progress. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I got the AC conditioner, I got the radiator out, got the front core support out. Um, I got the charge harness out right here. Gonna probably need that for the swap, if I'm not mistaken. I'm gonna take the engine harness just in case. So I'm gonna keep all of this. And then once we get that off, um, still need to drain the, the engine and the transmission fluid. But yeah, man, car's looking good. They're working on getting the doors off now. You can see things are going pretty good. and They're in real awkward positions. <laughs> Happy not to be done right now. But yeah, man, <sighs> it's the end to an era, man. This is my baby. This is my baby. I got head in the front seat multiple times. Had sex in the back seat. It was good times. And the first door is off. It's pretty weird to see this car just like coming apart, like as we speak. I mean, pretty cool though too. But yeah, man. And so you're not gonna be able to get the steering wheel off? God dang, bro. Yeah, See that? I it, it ain't no Phillips head going in that, bro. A Phillips head ain't gonna be able to cut through? Fuck no. What you need to take is a chisel and make a line and for a big ass flathead to go into it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's gonna be your best bet. Yeah. But yeah. Oh, shoot, bro. You already took out the, um, you already took out the witch call it. Check out the witch call it. Man, they got the cluster. <laughs> All right, y'all, so the engine is almost ready to come out. As you can see, she is rocking. So only two more mounts are in, that mount and this mount right here. Um, like I said before, doors are completely off. Everything's out. Oh, poor little car. Um, now we just need to take out the side skirts, then we're gonna pull the engine. All right, y'all, so we got it to the point where it's about time to pull the engine, getting some assistance here. So, yeah. So BJ's just measuring up uh, and to make sure that it's the right length on both sides. And then we are gonna start slowly creeping the engine on out. So wait for it. Ew, ew, ew. So you guys saw, super stoked. The engine is out. So we're gonna start cleaning up right now. And the car is basically stripped out from what was needed from it. The only other thing, we gotta grab these side skirts and we gotta work to get the steering wheel off. But everything else has been pretty much stripped as far as it's gonna go. So the plan is to clean up now. Um, help Brandon load up the rest of this stuff. Well, load up as much as he can into his car and then he'll come and get the rest um, tomorrow. The plan for the engine is to pull the transmission off uh, and then uh, pressure wash both of them individually, pull the exhaust manifold off because I don't need that. But I want to keep the intake on if possible um, and we'll see if it fits in the crate that I brought for it. But uh, these K-Series are pretty long motors, and by long, I mean, well, excuse me, tall motors. So, yeah, man, but super duper dope, super stoked. Yeah, man, so, catch y'all tomorrow. 
So day two, we're back again. So we're gonna start with uh, pulling apart um, the uh, transmission off the engine, uh, just so we can like prep these to get like power uh, washed and all that stuff, just so they're nice and clean. Got a bunch of degrees over here. So we're just gonna work on getting these apart now um, and getting them ready to ship. Ooh. All right, y'all. So my uh, GoPro I used the vlog to the shit up on me. So I'm using my time lapse GoPro for this for the update. But pretty much this is where we are at. My fault. Still attached to the tripod. So transmission is out. Took off the AC compressor starter. Took off the exhaust manifold. Um, now I'm working on taking off the intake manifold. And then I'm gonna go and power wash this there then from there we should be good to go make sure all the fluids and stuff are gone but yeah man things are coming together pretty well so stoked on that i'm gonna continue to work at this and then i'll give you all the update all right y'all so i'm recording from my phone my gopro had broke but from this is the end of the video uh so we got everything we needed to get done got the engine all created up um transmission is right here along with the alternator and the AC compressor. I still have to come back um, and finish these up, but for the most part, they are they are good to go. So, super stoked on this first piece to the case swap. Definitely gonna be a, a pretty interesting journey with this one. Um, but yeah, dude, yeah. So I hope you got, oh man. Yeah, but I hope you guys like the video. Take it easy, I'm out. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. Cold.